Hey all YouTube, what's going on? Welcome back to another Roblox Galaxy video. Before we start today's episode, I'd please like you to turn your attention to the right. See the blocky leaderboard? Yeah, Roblox has been up to their new stuff, so hope you guys aren't annoyed by that. I mean, hey, I mean, it's bigger and easier to read. Might help us all with admin command usage, huh? Nah, it's fine. Oh, different note. Make sure you guys are setting your alarms up for... I don't know, getting up ahead of time, because otherwise you're going to be like me, and you're going to be late for class, and which is going to really hurt your attendance, and, uh, yeah, your grade. <clears throat> yeah, get your daily high high beam out of the way, and let's just get started. Okay, so we got a nice, exciting selection of ships that I don't think anyone has ever used yet. Let's start with the first one. Uh, as soon as I add it to myself... Let's uh, ignore that since I already have it. Now, I believe the ship has received a remodel, but I cannot confirm that yet. Actually, I can confirm that through the read on the Wikipedia page. Um, no, the only thing the ship has received is a cargo hold upgrade. Okay, say hello to the oppressor. Like I said, say hello to the uh, oppressor. Nice ship, huh? Ooh, thought that said something on it. Okay, the the oppressor is a powerful for, for gate, and the uh, apparently the ship design is from Destiny One via the series Galliot. I've never heard of this ship before. I mean, I played Destiny Two though. Oh, it's one of the player. It's one of the uh, ships that um. It's one of the legendary jump ships, according to the uh, Destiny One Wikipedia page. Okay, with that out of the way, let's uh, let's get this review started. Again, the press was a frigate. It has 730 health, 350 shields, 380 hull. It has a it has an all right ex it has an excellent maneuverability, max speed of 220, acceleration of 30. And a turn speed of 0.75. It ha this ship does not have any turrets. Its, its focus is specifically on spinal firepower. Eight tiny cannons for the F spinal and two small phasers for the G spinal. I think the max turret range should be set to max spinal range. Range. Also, this thing uh, it has 65 cargo hold. But no manufacturing fee to build. What does it say for the description here? Technology study for decades has led to this beast of a war machine, which, as it launches, it leaves a blue of destruction in its wake with a powerful spinal armament. The oppressor is an excellent choice for hunting down wounded prey. Well, that's nice to know. This thing's, uh, this thing's like an annoying swarmer, so here we go. Ooh, look at this trail. How far is this boy gonna stretch? Hey, it kind of looks like a dagger, huh? Ah, yes, this is menacing right here. All right, let's see. Hey guys, look, check out this perfect alignment. Derelict Station, Myriad, Aquarius. All right, what damage can we do to Derelict? I like the design, I'm not gonna lie. Okay, if we were to look inside the ship while we're warping, you may notice there's only just a little cockpit in here. You guys see why that word's central in the community? Yeah, you guys see the uh, see the little pilot seat? Sorry, I can't tell if you have. I like the aesthetic design of the uh Who even made this ship is my question. I'll have to find that on the Wikipedia page. Okay. Now with that within firing range, let's do some real damage. Fire. Bang. Alright, we're 
just gonna move on after it. We gotta get closer for more damage. By the way, uh, can't tell the coronavirus situation is getting worse, but stay safe, y'all. Again, just keep your hands washed, that sort of thing. That's all everyone is advising you to do. We'll just stop at the six minute mark. I can't tell if it will be like a whole minute since we've done this, but we'll find out later. And you know what, let's just dock. Yeah, kind of useful though for firing, right? It looks like there's a torpedo spot right there. Perfect for a small torpedo. I eventually need to do a review of a uh, Dalek station because this thing has gone under a lot of design changes. Okay. Nope. And here we are. How much damage do we do? You know, for a little brigade, brigade we did almost 1,500 damage in just a minute. A swarm of these could really tear down a prototype, you know what I mean? Wink. Bleachers, wink. Yeah, let's do that one next. Okay, I highly recommend that, uh, I would highly recommend the oppressor if you want to do some shield damage to ships. I mean, that still was a lot in under a minute. Yeah, alright, let's go on the next ship. See y'all later, and uh, thank you for the 378 subscribers. We're getting close to 500. I, didn't, I don't ask you guys to do this. I mean, I'll leave it in the description, but it's your choice if you want to subscribe to the channel or not. I'm not enforcing the policy on that. Now, I am enforcing the policy that we don't get free credits in Galaxy, except for a refund request and wanting Avid events, specifically targeting one user on that. Don't bug me about it, okay? Thank you. Yeah, with that out of the way, let's just uh, end this episode here. Bye, y'all. I really do mean it. This victory is for y'all.